Why that don't train team? It's your boy D Neil back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with why is Germany so rich and powerful? Before we answer this question, make sure you subscribe to the channel, ring the notification bell, give the video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. Social media and Patreon are all up top. If you're not subscribed to any of it, put all the links in the description. All you gotta do is hit the link, follow me, talk to me. Love talking to you guys. Uh, and if you guys got a favorite video suggestion, you can subscribe to Patreon or drop it in the comment section. What we got? It's one of the world's largest economies. This country produces more than $3 trillion of goods God, and services. Dang. It's just behind the US, China, and Japan. This Jeez. place has the most rich people after the US and China, and its economy is bigger than the UK. I'm talking about oh Germany. This economy is really bigger than the UK? Its economy is bigger than the UK. I'm talking about Germany. This country is the economic engine of Europe. Here is the birthplace of some of the biggest global companies you and I see all the time. Like Mercedes-Benz, BMW, really? Hugo Boss, Siemens, global software giant, SAP, and even T-Mobile. So why is Germany- I did not know Germany was the birthplace of some of these, bro. That's crazy! Software giant, SAP, and even T-Mobile. So why is Germany so rich and powerful? This country has a very open economy. Ranked as more open and accessible than the US, Japan, and the UK. But let's Jeez. go over three main reasons why Germany became so rich and powerful. The first is exporting. Germans export high quality products globally and especially to their neighbors. See, in the US, you're used to seeing Mercedes Benz as the luxury car. But in many countries, Mercedes is also public buses, delivery trucks, police cars, and taxis. Mercedes is worth more than $25 billion. But aside from vehicles, Germany's biggest exports are actually machinery. Germany is ranked amongst the top countries for its high quality machinery, next to Korea and Japan. And it exports billions of dollars worth of high quality God equipment that's dang. used by companies around the world. The industries with the most jobs here are vehicle construction and engineering, including electrical and chemical engineering. The second is German innovation. Hold up, Germany? I, I didn't know about all this. The, the export. I didn't even know Mercedes did all that. I didn't know Mercedes had all different kind of vehicles like that. That's crazy. Hold on, Germany! Hey, hey, I'm learning some things in this video. Including electrical and chemical engineering. The second is German innovation. It was ranked amongst the top innovative nations by the World Economic Forum. The nation is often seen as a leader within the EU for its innovation initiatives, and it spends more than 3% of its GDP on research and development. And the third is immigration. Unlike China or Japan or even its European neighbors, Germany has relatively open borders. This country actually likes immigrants and foreigners. They hey, like not only that. welcome them, but they see them as necessary to help grow its economy. Germany was ranked 12th in the OECD when it comes to share of immigrants in its population. Today, foreign-born people account for 13% of its population. And wow. here in Berlin, you have one of the most diverse cities in Europe. You hear so many different languages being spoken from English, Spanish, Italian, Arabic. And when it comes to food, you have pretty much everything. At this intersection alone, I see Turkish, I see Korean, I see Mexican, Italian, Thai, and Vietnamese. And I am a Germany, y'all just doing a thing over there. Y'all just doing a thing over there, but I absolutely love, I admire, and I respect uh, the the openness that you accept immigrants with uh, the openness is absolutely incredible to not uh where, where you feel like it's it's necessary you know what i'm so it's necessary for them to, to help grow your economy so you keep like an open borders type of policy uh i really respect that and i really admire that Korean, I see Mexican, Italian, Thai, and Vietnamese. An IMF study found that migrants into a country has a net positive impact on its economy, including higher innovation and a more educated workforce. So how did Germany get here? 
Well, for centuries, Germany was a center of European politics and art. Meanwhile, car making is deeply rooted in Germany's history. It actually became home of the world's largest automotive company back in 1900. And it's also really? believed that its union culture was kind of what kept wages low. This resulted in relatively lower product costs and more profitable exports, which then allows companies to grow faster and invest more in research and development. Germany was enjoying strong economic growth until COVID happened. Liebe Mitbürgerin, liebe Mitbürger. Its economy contracted largely due to its factories having to shut down along with global supply chain issues. But despite all its successes so far, today it's facing major challenges. While some economists still predict its economy will steadily grow, others say Germany's economy is recovering slower than expected after COVID and slower than other big countries. And they blame an aging workforce, Russia's invasion of Ukraine, and even China's slowing economy. But can Germany remain rich and one of the most powerful countries on our planet? Check out more of my videos and don't forget to subscribe. I think they can and I think they will. Uh, that was cool. I gotta check out some more of his videos. I really rocked with that. Uh, that was a cool video. That's all we got for this one. If you guys got a favorite video suggestion, you can subscribe to Patreon or drop it in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel, ring notification bell, hit the video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. Social media and Patreon are all up top. You know, subscribe to any of it. Put all the links in the description. All you gotta do is hit the link, follow me, talk to me. Love talking to you guys. You guys are the most incredible team on YouTube. It's your boy Dino. Out.